This isn't real. None of this is real. We all live in the Matrix. None of this is real. Don't believe anything you see. You think we're in 1403 Bohemia, right? Well, all you have to do is look up. Because there is a drone stuck in the tree. Yenda, we aren't in Biscuit Town anymore. Hello, you sexy biscuits, and welcome back into Kingdom Come and Deliverance. Good day, madam. Got to love the friendliness of everyone here. Good morning, floating arrow. Good morning, paving stone. Good morning, chicken. <laughs> Good morning, wagon wheel. Good morning, pants. I don't do this every time I play the game. No, no. So I might have some bad news. I've waited two days and there's been no new judging missions. I think I might have done them all. There was one that you guys didn't see that I wasn't recording and it was probably the funniest one. So I'm really disappointed. So you know what? We're going to have to do it ourselves. Would the accused please step up to the bench? Hello, sire. Uh, well, look, the other day I was over there and I found a dead body. A dead body, you say? Oh my god! Yeah, it was, uh, it was cold and dead-like. What? So, uh, I was wondering if I could keep it. Sorry, you want to keep a dead body? What? Well, you know how people have, uh, teddy bears they could hug on to. Well, I, I don't have enough money for that, so I thought, well, well, why not have a life-size teddy bear? I can only see your logic. Well, as long as you promise to get rid of it when it starts smelling. Thank you, Bailiff. It's just not the same, is it? We currently have 13,000 in our bank, which is perfect. So that will give us some leeway to be able to build some more things. I'm going to do something for myself today. Yes, because I, Henry, bailiff of Biscuit Town, am going to extend my rat house. That sounds dirtier than it should have. Extended rat house, long hearts are sick. Damn, this song got quite dirty. Look at that man's sack. Sorry, that didn't help. Oh my god, this place looks incredible. This house is fine for the bailiff of Biscuit Town. This place looks incredible. And here's our book over here. What's in here then? Okay, so we've got a kind of a meeting area. There's a chest in here. And there's some nightgowns and an undershirt. Okay. Oh, so this is your office then, is it? Do I finally get an office that probably isn't haunted? Great. <laughs> Wait, is this my room, is it? You just, you just shoved me in the attic. Thanks, Morius. So I'm guessing this is some more living quarters and... This must be my room, I assume. I love the look of these windows. It looks so nice. I really like this place. It looks awesome. Until I saw that. And that looks like a screaming face, doesn't it? It's got the two eyes and a bleh. <laughs> Well, I'm not sleeping in that bed, that's for sure. So, we now have the extended rat house. So what I'm going to do is build ourselves a lovely garden. Carrots and beetroot and turkey legs. Wait, they don't grow in a garden. Here is our garden. Wow, this looks amazing. Oh my god, and you can pick all of the separate flowers. That's going to come in really handy for doing alchemy. And talking of alchemy... Well, that wasn't creepy. Oh, okay, so yeah, here it is. And in this chest, we have nothing. Story of my life, though. Ah, it's been a while since I visited the yeast confection. Good health to you, Henry. Good day to you, madam. I'll call you Barbara. They're coming to get you, Barbara. So, have you started making my bourbons yet? Oh. Okay. What is it? There's something missing from the biscuit bakery. Do you happen to know what's missing from the Biscuit Bakery? Yes, that's correct. The biscuits! There's no biscuit in the Biscuit Bakery. How do you expect me to call Biscuit Down Biscuit Down if there's no bloody biscuits? Sorry, Barbara. It's very hard on me. You know, I've got a lot of stress in my life and... 
<sighs> Gotta run a whole town all by myself. Got bloody Morius over there trying to take as much money as he can. And you're not helping by not making bloody biscuits. I'll see you later, Barbara. Okay, I need to get some air. I think the biggest thing here is the... I miss pebbles. <laughs> We're out now, pebbles. We're out now. There is a boar in the middle of the road staring me down. I wonder if I can get him with my bow. Oh, <laughs> that was right between. <laughs> I didn't even hit the boar. It went between its legs. Terrible godless thing has happened. I know, right? It's right here. So I did have a comment from Zayad who said, Biscuit, can you please tell me the name of the clothes you have on in this video? Okay, so in that video, I was wearing this, the Saxon Dyed Gamberson. Highly recommended. It looks awesome. I, I really like the look of this one. Plus some just standard trousers. And no shoes, which is why I'm going to get some now. Hello, you shits. I'm Henry, bailiff of Biscuit Town. Please can you direct me to your nearest Clark store? I'm guessing those weren't invented yet. It it's basically a shoe shop. D do you have one of those? Good day. I'm looking for shoes. Oh, come on. How hard is it to sell shoes? They're a common thing, you know? Everyone has them on their feet. You do. I don't. You know? Ugh. Of course, the original owner of this game save probably has shoes in their chest. Yes, some nobleman's boots. Well, I've rested my feet in their brand new shoes. And uh, yeah, today's been a long day. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's episode. Upcoming videos, I am going to be doing a Mafia 3 video. I know a lot of people in my Mafia 2 video said that, well, Mafia 3 sucks. And yes, there are certain aspects of it that do. But I am going to show you some positives. And we all should be more positive in this world. Also, I have a Patreon. If you want to go send me a dollar or something, that would mean the absolute world to me. But anyway, thanks so much for watching, but until next time, that's me. Out. Bye, guys.